We came out the huddle and coach just said it's winning time. And it's like I see you guys like Terrell make all these clutch free throws and I just try to make put my team on the shoulders for that two free throws so we can the game. For you, um, it may not have been your best night um, field goal wise. I think you were maybe one for ten. So was it important to you to make up for it on the stretch? Yeah, definitely. Like once we got to uh, once it was three minutes left in the game, but the second half you just can't worry about stuff like that. When you start missing shots, you just gotta keep playing and finish out the game and make sure that your team wins. So what's it feel to get a, a win like this over a team like Butler? It's, that, that game from last year has been on our mind since last year. So once they came in this arena, we knew from day one we had to be, we had to be ready because they're a really good team, physical, play great defense. And as a unit, my, me and my teammates, we just play hard and we got the victory. That's uh, three games now you guys have pulled off on your home court this year at the last minute like that. Can you guys just describe what that has been like for you guys to keep that streak going? I mean, uh, I think what we're up to like 28 now, right? Yeah. Um, and we just we just play really well here. Our fans are, are always behind us. Uh, the crowd tonight was unreal. Um, yeah, I mean, those, the, when it comes down to it, we just have like an extra energy in this building. And uh, coming down in the last uh, couple minutes of the game, there, you know, you just don't even, you don't feel the fatigue. You don't feel any of that stuff when you got uh, you know 10,000 people cheering. You know, it's, uh, just so much adrenaline. So. I think uh, that's a big reason for us pulling off all these wins. I mean, wouldn't like it to be that close, but if it is, a win's a win. Kenny, you guys had a big rebounding edge tonight. What, do you, what were you guys doing inside? And um, you know, last the last two years, I think combined, Matt Howard's had about a thousand offensive rebounds on us. So um, it was a big emphasis for us to box him out and uh, just sort of get onto the boards early and. Try and get, try and keep him up early, and then uh, I think that sort of um, led into the end of the game there. When uh, I mean, Ate, me, Jamel, uh, Jeff, everybody was rebounding, rebounding really well. So. Kenny, you had one of your best games tonight, and came off the bench in the first half. Um, talk about what what you saw there, and did you think that Matt Howard's fouls had anything to do with the way he was playing inside? For uh, I mean, he's a he's a great player. Um, you know, he's he's a smart player, really savvy, on, especially on the defensive end with uh, his post defense, taking charges, things like that. So uh, I think he was a little. Um, I think he didn't want to take as many charges and stick and things like that in fear of getting a blocking foul when he had so many fouls at the end of the game. So um, I mean, I think uh, when it comes down to it, I was just. Given, just given it, uh, just scoring how the game was telling me to, and I was trying to help my teammates out, setting good screens, and uh, you know when it comes down to it, we were playing as a team tonight, and that's why we won. Jamal, um, you guys did tonight what you've been trying to do for the last couple games: um, get offensive rebounds, rebound period, scoring transition. What what was it about tonight that you know it brought it all together? Um, I think a lot of it has to do with we were, we were well rested. We had about six or seven days off, and we got a chance to catch our legs and you know take a break from playing every other two days or something. And so in practice, we've been you know emphasizing going hard and trying to take advantage of uh, you know Butler's young young post players. And I think you know Jeff, Rob, A.T., Kenny, and myself, we did a great job of just staying on the boards and you know just just trying to you know get all the loose balls out there. Today. Coming up after the last game, a loss before this, did you need this win? Did you need a, a big win and a big stage to kind of show what you guys are and what you might be? Yeah, I mean, it's, it's a quality win, uh, especially when it comes to Butler, who's probably going to finish first or second in their, in their league. So, I mean, anytime you could, you know, get a win like that on your resume, come come the end of the year, you know, the committee has to look at that, that win. Uh, because Butler's probably going to win 20 something odd games this year. So, I mean, it was a great win. And, uh, you know, we have seven, eight days to prepare for our weight. So, I mean, it's, it's a lot better practicing on a win than it is a loss, I'll tell you that. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.